brutally honest therapy and i'm your therapist mikey today i have with me in the goddamn office <sighs> internet aaron There's There's round round round. Round. yeah 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 round of applause round of applause round of applause there we go there we go, there we go, there we go. Type, type, you see me yeah, yeah yeah we we don't see him but we see him type beat uh, we're me. gonna we're gonna bring people up from the live stream and the discord yeah, yeah, we're gonna put them in. Th well, they're in therapy. They can confess to us or 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 or, or, or try to get some advice on something. Simba and Aaron are gonna be Simba and Aaron, but I'm gonna be brutally honest. All right, Dude, let's get to this. That's a good question. All right. Hey, I, I wouldn't come in here with no real world problems, bro. If I was you, that's, that's if you care about your mental health, Jinx. don't come. Uh, How are doing? I'm doing fine. It's been a while since I talked to y'all. Oh, What's going on, drink? Glad you're back, man. Glad you're still alive out here in these yeah. streets. <laughs> a little bit. Well, no, I'm, 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 I'm from only so you can watch us, but other than you know, I'm in what? preschool. Say it again. I got expelled out in preschool. Remember? Ah, okay, okay, okay. Okay, 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 okay right, right, right. All right. Uh, welcome to therapy. You got anything you want to talk to us about, man? You got any uh, yeah. anything to get off your chest? Yeah, I just um, it feels like I'm losing touch with one of my friends. Like this is someone who I've known since since third grade, right? Mm. This is like my brother, right? Right. But like, I'm I'm not sure if I should just let it go at this point, you know? Uh huh. Well, yeah, you two are, are are adults now. Mm, no, still teenagers. Okay, okay, okay. So you've been mm -hmm. friends since the third grade, mm. and. And are y'all are y'all any in any classes together? You're still at the same school? How was how was the situation looking? Oh, we were never in the same school. Same oh, aftercare. Yeah. Same, same what? Same what? Aftercare. Same aftercare. So you a teenager in daycare? <laughs> but something like that. Hmm. What What do you mean something like that? Something like that. Do you in the in daycare or you ain't, man? What's going on? <laughs> It ain't. It's for like after school if your parents can't pick you up. Usually they'll send it to you after care. Mm. Ah, nigga, you got no car. Okay, 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 okay. Type, 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 type. type shit. Okay, okay. So y'all like y'all don't hang out together anymore? Or like, what's the what's what's going on? Yeah, honestly, I've tried reaching out a lot to hang out, just mm. do my stuff, but I think uh, I guess I really tried back, and I really, I think I should oh. just do it at this point. So you try to hang out. You like, ah, that's my homie. I want to like go yeah. bowling, play basketball or something, play some cards. And he just like, don't reply. Yeah. Is it more of a don't reply or is it more of a like a tell you yeah and just blow you off when it's actually time? Oh, don't reply. Mm. Could, could he have a life situation going on? Like how right, long has right. this been going on? No. I call him. I call him a while back. To, like he was like, uh, I guess school's busy trying to give him out. He was like, no, school's not busy. I asked about school. So let's go over it. And it's like, Does he have a girlfriend? Not anymore. He used to, but yeah, how long? How long? How long has he been single, to your knowledge? To my knowledge, the past three, you know, the past four years. Oh damn, damn! He just don't fuck with you. Uh, yeah, get that nigga out of here. Yeah, get get him out of here. Yeah, he, he, he ain't trying to hang. He ain't trying to hang, Clay. It, it could be a lot of reasons. Um, he could have, he could have something he's going through that he he can't really discuss with people, or he he's just trying to figure out stuff on his own. Mm -hmm. Life has a crazy way of having stuff going on, and people don't always know how to let folks in and let their friends in. If y'all if y'all have been close that long, bro, um, you know. What I would suggest, uh, extend the olive branch. Hey man, uh, if you need me, I'm here. Um, you know, I don't know what's going on. You've been, you've been, I don't know, bro. I don't know. Look, bro. I don't okay. know what's going so on question. with you. If you need, question. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. What? what? Scratch what? everything that Aaron what said. Was, fuck whoa. all that shit. Whoa. Fuck all whoa. that shit. Whoa. If y'all <laughs> friends, y'all friends. If he ain't yeah. fucking with it, you know what I'm saying? That's when you got to cut off the dead roots, man. Yeah, you know what I'm yeah. saying? And you see, you got to cut off the dead roots to blossom. The relationship dead, friendship mm -hmm, dead. Mm -hmm. You know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? Mm -hmm. He don't fuck with you like that, Twin. He trying to let you know that. So, like, you mean, like, you should, like, not fuck with him even harder. 
and like glow up on that nigga and like get a million dollars and shit and then he'll want to be your friend again. When he get his next girlfriend, fuck her. Push, push up on her. Whoa. Fuck whoa. Her. Yeah. Lick her butt. Whoa. 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 Essentially, of course. No, 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 no. Don't fuck her because you, you know what I'm saying? We, I'm li- we're okay. not old enough for that yet. But like, kiss her, though. kiss her though. Okay. I don't think you should listen to either consent, one of these. But with consent. consent. With consent. With consent. Yeah, yeah. Look, real, nah, real question. No ideal stuff. No ideal stuff. Real, real question, though. Real question, though. Like, okay, he obviously ignores you when you ask to hang out, but does he ignore you when it's just like normal conversation? Yes. Oh, so he's just ignoring you all around? Yeah. Oh, fuck that nigga, bro. Let, let yeah. Him, let him yeah, yeah, see, if you know what I'm saying? Go- Aaron yeah. trying to be the nice guy. Yeah, yeah, be Come on, man. Now, if you feel it in your heart and you want to be the nice guy like Aaron over here, you can like extend the olive branch for one good time. Hey, if you're going, I really, you know what I'm saying, wish we could kick it. If you're going through something, I'm here for you, blah, blah, blah. And if, if it's nothing after that, it's nothing after that. You didn't just you you extended the olive branch and then you let him go if he don't ever reply. That's on him. He gonna be lonely and single, and, not single, but lonely and all that shit. He go through that shit on his own if he want no help type shit. You know what I'm saying? You can't force somebody to talk. You feel me? So, it is what it is. Type shit. Thanks. Okay, I guess we. I guess also thanks. Thanks oh, for that advice. Yeah, if you, I mean, if you, next if time you, Mikey go through stuff, we just gonna abandon him. No, oh, I didn't yeah. say that. No. I didn't say no. that. No. For sure. You know I what I'm saying? When you have his crash out moments, hey, oh, yeah, we just gonna let him go. Yeah, we just gonna let him go. You know what I'm saying? Like you when know? I was when I was crashing out, when I was crashing out, yeah. you know what I'm you, saying? No, you wasn't talking, they, bro. They so, they but asked, you right, you were they I appreciate that. We're gonna let you go. We're gonna let you go. They asked about it and then it was my choice to respond or not. And he and didn't. So I did it. So they had every right. They had every right. So that is to that. Like, according to his logic, he don't fuck with us no more. Yeah, All for right. Sure. But so now we know something. The, the second part of that is if, oh, yeah, if he, off, so. when it's time, he'll come back if he really want to get it off his chest when it's time. Yeah, yeah we're going we're gonna cut him off. Yeah, yeah fuck all that extra shit. Okay, for sure. Appreciate you, Jinx man. We glad you got. You know what I'm saying? Reach out, do what you gotta do. It. If he don't hit back, you just gonna have to cut that off, bro. Thanks. Feel me? Subscribe to Internet oh. City and some of the God, they're the goats. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Why he said it like that? He didn't have to say it like that. He could have just said subscribe, but it is what it is. <clears throat> Dark Machine! Hello. Oh, you didn't sound like I was hoping you would. Okay. <laughs> Hello. Hi, Hi. Hi. Oh, yeah, I'm normal. <laughs> what do you want to get off your chest today, man? Um... I've been uh, wanting to uh, wait. What? Are you able to mute stream? I'm not sure if I'd get banned for saying that. If I would get you banned for saying this, what is it? What can you give us a hint before you say it? Um, um, overdosing. You've been having dark thoughts. No, I've been attempting the dark thoughts. Why have you been doing this, my brother? Um, because I hate myself and my life. Is it like a, like your situation, I, or is no, it fixable not really things? A situ- it's like I don't know the word for it. Um, um how, how, old how old are you? How old are you? Um. 15 okay 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 so is this is this home life related school life related what are we talking like a mixture of both like school life yeah i get bullied every once in a while but like it's like my parents sort of invalidate my problems which is Mm -hmm. not fun yeah okay okay understandable understandable and then my therapist uh, I, I got a therapist, right? You got a therapist. You know, okay, good. Yeah. And then uh, he starts talking about weird ass shit like um, skibbity toilet and PJ masks. What? Wait. This what? is like a 30 year old man. Huh? huh? What? Wait. I, I'm, I'm not joking. Uh, wait. Your therapist 
So you tell him something serious, and he bring up yeah. skibbity toilet. Yeah. Are you paying for this therapist? Yeah. I think it's time to find a new therapist. I'm not gonna lie to you. Number one, yeah. Number one. Find number one, find a new therapist. Number two, exercise the use of um school adult figures, you know, yeah. somebody you could trust or possibly trust, whether that's a counselor or a favorite teacher or a coach or principal, assistant principal, lunch lady, anybody. Anybody, anybody willing to give an ear. Um, yeah. And to, to add on to what Mikey's saying, um, I know what it's like for life to feel like it's really bad, um, but I will say, dude, you're 15... And you got a lot of good years to come, you got bro. A lot. You got a lot of good years. A in lot three of good years, years, you'll be a legal adult and able to fully make your own decisions. That's not a long time from now, my brother. So I will not say this. Time. Um, Find you someone who you can, you know, discuss how you're feeling with, who can meet you on your on that level. And lastly, one more thing to tell you. Um. Bro, parents don't get it a lot of times. Um, no, one, thing, uh, one thing a lot of people have to, to realize, um, this is all our first time doing this, including our parents. Yeah. This is our first time living, learning, trying to be good adults. And sometimes it's, it's, it's harder than others. And your feelings and problems are in fact valid. It's just sometimes people are so blinded in their, in their current situation, they can't see past it. Um, if you put it into perspective that, let's take, for example, the fact that you got three years until you're 18, right? Legally, yeah. at 18, you can get your own job, your own place. It might not work smooth as you want, but you could do all of that legally without a problem. So mm-hmm. if we really think about it, the problems you might have now are temporary. Cause to be honest, a lot, lot of the problems are temporary. It's, it's, like, it's a lot of it is temporary. If you if we think about it, if we say, oh, let's look, let's think about COVID, right? When when COVID well, was happening, that shit felt like, damn, it might be the end of the world. A whole lot of shit. And like, I'm pretty sure all of us have very vivid memories of COVID. It was it's four, been four years already since COVID. Four, three, four, whatever you want, however you want to count it. Been three, four years already. That's how fast time is flying. It was temporary. Now the disease still exists technically, but it was temporary. We made it out. We we on to whole new chapters of life. So you can't fix a temporary problem with a permanent solution. You know what I'm saying? Just just find somebody you can talk to, school figure, family member. Uh, if your parents just don't get it, sometimes they don't get it. Sometimes they might have grew up a certain way. And they just don't see it how you see it. You know what I'm saying? That's their first yeah. time being a parent and all of that. It's your first time being a teenager. You know, so, you know, just... Just remember, bro, it's... it's it, bro, like I say, it's all our first time at this. Life, life can be hard sometimes, but mm-hmm. you always get to a point where you look back at the bad and you really love the good. So don't hang up on it. It gets better. Precisely. And also, uh, I forgot where I was going with this. Uh, sometimes people are, are, are stuck in their own world because everybody's the main character in their own world. Just like you're the main character in your world. So every, you can't always blame how people react on them being a horrible person or whatever. It might just be they don't mean it, but they just don't see it. So, I mean, there are obviously bad people in the world, but who knows? You know what I'm saying? So find somebody to talk to. Fire! That therapist, because to even yeah, like, bring up Skippy, be totally is insane. And 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 Paw Patrol or what? Ask why we even talking about this? Hey, get that nigga out of here, bro! Get him out of here! Hey, you get paying that. for him? Get him the frick out of here! Yeah, no. Fire him, bro! Fire <laughs> him, bro! And then again, Phantom Tax. Yeah, 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 yeah bro. Could, get him crazy. out of there, bro! But yeah, that's 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 our best advice to you, my brother. All right, man. We we want to see you back. Want to see you back, back in the, the chat, streams. back in the comments, and wherever yeah. you hang out, brother. 
in the yeah. Discord. Okay. Don't go nowhere, bro. You W I D C. Feel me? Hi. Yeah, All right, Darkness. You. You, you have a you have a great night. Me too. Yes, sir, Ski. And I go for the rest of you fuckers too. God damn it. Let's see here. Who was who did I see here? We just gonna go alphabetical. Aiden. Hello. Hello. Uh, oh, you unmuted. Now can you speak? Can you speak? You can't speak. If you're watching the stream and you're in the waiting room, test your mic in the waiting room. That's what it's for, nigga. <clears throat> Boom dog. Hello. How you doing? Um, pretty good. What about you? God, 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 God. We here, here. Let's see what you got to get off your chest, man. Uh, uh I don't got a lot. It don't, don't got to be a lot, man. What you, you know what I'm saying? You popped in the waiting room, big dog. You know what I'm saying? What you, what you got going? What? What? What just happened? What just happened? I have no clue. I didn't. He's wrong, 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 and left. You and this, if you in this goddamn Uh, waiting room. W if you in this waiting room and you're you not here for therapy, get the fuck out! Hey, I ain't here to talk about what the fuck they got talk about. God damn it! God damn it! Shit! Damn! What the fuck? I don't. Cherry slushy. How art thou? We can't hear you if you're talking, but you are unmuted, but we can't hear you. E mad. Back to life. Unmute yourself. How are you? This is this is this this is this is this is this is you know what maybe maybe that's our cue. What the fuck? What the fuck is happening? You're terrible. Book of vibes. I see you all. Book of vibes. How we doing? Book of vibes. The dog. Maybe it's us. Is it the is Discord the problem? Can you hear me now? Can you hear me? Book of vibes. Yeah, yeah. All right. So I got about two things I need. Some help on. We ain't right. here for two, uh, nigga. We, what's the most important, nigga? Um, I have this one friend for about like four years now. Right, right, right. She be doing some some very questionable, idiotic things. So this is a girl best friend. Yeah, this is a female best friend. You like her? So me and her, we, we we've known each other for a long time. So I practically you know. Just ignore how she me, for no, no, I said yeah. She might. Yeah. Be sure. no, I'm saying you, you like her like that. No. Okay, she just she's you friend zoned her in your head. Yeah. Okay, okay. Each other really. So right. but yeah. Uh you know each other for a long time, so I know how she'll think. But lately she's been like acting like really weird. She's been ghosting right every now and then, then coming in contact and then just spam ping me everybody on Discord and whatnot, and then just go out of nowhere. So I wanna know should I just like stop talking to her? But she don't talk to me no more like we used to. Do you know her in real life? Um, like outside of this, I suppose I would. Like we know, we know things about each other and that IRL friends would. But because we live in different states, we haven't met full on. Oh well, we'll fuck her then. What? Yeah, man. Come on, man. Come on, you knew the answer. You knew. Yeah, the answer. you knew. Drop, what? drop that like a book at the drop off. You good on that? But the thing is, she's like one of those depression. She's got like depression and all that stuff. I don't no, give no, a no, damn. No, 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 no. She only got depression when it's convenient. Yeah, she sound. That's what she said. She ghosting and all. If you was, if you, if you really had depression, you need somebody to talk to. When I ask you to talk, you would talk. Okay, right. 
we just seen the brother come up in here he, he 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 wanted to talk so he found people to talk to he hired a therapist and all that stuff they want to talk they want to talk she want to be a friend she won't be a friend some people be using that depression as, a, as an excuse and stuff be faking it okay get up out of here. I, see, I see what you're getting at get up out of here. what's the what's the other one what's the other problem you got that would oh be yeah awesome. i recently this one is not as big as that one is, but recently I got hit by a car. Whoa, oh, that's right. big as shit. Nick, 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 did you look both ways before you crossed the street? Oh, yeah, I looked four times, actually. Four times. I was walking past the car. Look, you wear glasses? They don't walk in front of me. Look, you wear glasses? I walked past that car. I got hit by a different car. I didn't look, even you wear glasses? No. I have, I have perfect 2020 vision. Yeah, obviously mm -hmm. not. Okay. 2020 vision. All right, so break it down. What happened, book? All right, so I was dropping my baby sister off at daycare and shit, right? Mm -hmm. I stop at the light. I start crossing it once it changes. I mm -hmm. look both ways as I'm walking because I, I like to play it safe and whatnot. Mm -hmm. The instant I turn to my left after that one car drove off in front of me after running that light, next thing I know, I wake up in the ambulance. What? what? With a broken arm. Damn, like, man, truck him. I, Whoa. I don't think it, it might have been because <laughs> they was a full on thing and run too. So Apparently, they ran, they ran the light? I hit by the car. I landed on another car. They drove and shook me off and I landed underneath that car. So wait, wait, wait. Did they stop or no? Um, The person who hit me initially? Yeah. No, they drove off. The oh, it was a hit and run? Yeah. Wait, yeah, you got hit twice? Run. Whoa. Uh, no, I got hit once, and then I landed on another car, and then they tried to drag, like, shake me off. Oh, oh, oh. So after I landed, <laughs> they on the car, treated no, you like a me. bug. Go <laughs> <laughs> ahead, bug. I'm listening okay, to him. Something. But anyways, I wake up in a hospital, and next thing I know, apparently they just drove off and whatnot. I have a broken arm now, a fractured pelvis. A fractured spine in two different Damn. places next to my neck and my pelvis. How and long ago was this? Was this was a week ago. No. Damn! So are, you, you, are you home? Oh, yeah, I'm home right now. I'm chilling. I'm laying down right now. Shit. Well, the best you can, but okay. Let's show. Um, it's not a so I, mean, I still go to 7 Eleven. That's like a 20 minute walk. You, oh, you stop. can walk still. Oh, yeah, I can walk. Like, it wasn't like no broken leg, but oh, my leg you was. All right, shake it like, off. Yeah, my leg was like banged up, so I couldn't really walk without a crutch. Okay. Without, and even when I did walk, it was like pain and whatnot. Okay. You know what the sad part is though? They ain't find a dude who hit me. Oh, they not. Right. They not. Yeah. So, yeah, right well, what advice you need about this situation? <laughs> what you want me to uh, do? More like, you? what should I just do? Like, y'all got any advice on how I should just cope with this? Because this, this is just really annoying. I ain't gonna lie. You gonna have to make jokes about it, twin. There ain't <laughs> yeah, nothing real. So you, you can do. You can do. <laughs> Silver fell and broke her back, and we just cracked jokes about it for real. I didn't even break my back. My fault. She failed. Yeah, like, just she yeah, hurt herself. Yeah, type I, shit. I, you know, I was a little really? sore, nigga, bro. Yeah, the me yeah. tripping and him getting hit by a car is two different things, dude. You are gonna have to look both ways yeah, three really. times. That's the we just gonna have to you, take you, it as a lesson, twin. You gotta, you got more fall damage. Yeah, it's definitely fall damage. You just gotta take it as, bro. Yeah. It was a crazy ass, coinky dink coincidence. And um, wait, so were you walking on like a like like were you jaywalking? Or were no, you at a crossing? Walk. No, I don't jaywalk. You was at I a don't crossing. I don't, I don't risk that. Well, actually, no, that's a lie. But no, I wasn't jaywalking. It was at a normal street light. And so I changed, I waited for the light to change. I started walking. You waited and I'm looking for the ways. street light or the walking light? The walking light. The walk, the walk. They so ran a you, light and hit him. He was in the right. right. No, yeah, it was yes. a full on okay. red light run. Like, I, okay. I waited a second on purpose just to be safe. And then I started walking. And then yeah. as I'm in the middle of, like, I'm right about to get to the other side of the street. So w were you old karma for anything? Don't sound like karma. I said that sped the instant I was in front of it. So I'm starting to think it was a hate crime. You hate on me because I'm black. No, like, were you old karma for anything? Was you, like, fucking with somebody? You did something to somebody? Oh, no. you, you know what I'm saying? Bullied somebody, something like that? Maybe like maybe like getting jumped wise because I like to fuck with people a lot, but nothing that's worthy of getting hit by a car. No, 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 like no, 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 no. So, what do you mean you like to fuck with people a lot? 
like I'll say some some funny like things. Jokes. It's funny. Like, I'll make I'll make stupid jokes. I don't make nothing like no crazy super offensive jokes. That's too far. But I like to just say some things that'll make you mad, but you know full well that I'm joking. I'm not serious. Okay, I'm just making sure you ain't had no karma coming your way because that's. That's just, a, that's just a bad no, dink. In my life I was getting hit by a car. Yeah, that's that's just a bad dink. You just gotta take that one on the chin or the leg or the arm, wherever it is. You just gotta take that twin. <laughs> the funny part is, well, I stood up after I got hit by the car too. Like I stood up after I rolled off and everything. That was the interesting part to me. I stood up. Are you lying to us? You just and then passed out. The hospital. I swear. That's what, what they told me. That's what everybody else oh. had told me. I was they found me just standing up. So they ragdolled you. And yeah. And you stood up un- like, but you Why don't you remember. Did, I just hit the reset button. Yeah, yeah, tight shit, tight shit. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, we can't we can't give you no advice on that one. You just Yeah, yeah for that man, that. you that, that's just a that's just one of those you like, damn, that's a it's a story to bring up on uh first dates. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's a first date story. Yeah. You know, I got hit by a like, car once. I'll get what? hit by a car for you, Shorty. Like I'm like, that's I'm a hell of an icebreaker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Okay. Thanks for yeah, that, just, 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 just find humor in it, bro. The yeah. you survived it. You know, come up with a nickname. You know what I'm saying you call you call yourself like train wreck. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Car wreck. You feel me? All right. all the, all the heavy hitter. <laughs> heavy. You know what I'm saying, come up with a nickname. You know what I'm saying. Truck the stick or like that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Broke of broken mm-hmm. arms. Yeah, type shit. Type shit. Type shit. We appreciate you, man. Coming on. Place the boneless or something. Yeah. yeah. Boneless would be cool. Mm. Yeah, you good, Book bro. Bones Just or something. Find yeah. humor in it, bro. Find humor in it. Sure. Vroom, vroom. Thanks, oh, that's All right, man. All right, mate. Uh, oop, oop. Shit, v- shit, shit. Vroom, vroom. Vroom, vroom. <sighs> come, come. Gabby, wabby. Uh, do, 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 like, Hello, Gabby. Gabby. Hello. Nice little profile picture you got there, Gabby. Um. Well, right now I'm not too. I'm not doing too good. Um. I recently lost my grandmother on the thirteenth oh. of this month, and um, and right now she uh she passed away in California. Um. And her funeral is not until like the thirty first, so I'm not gonna be able to like see her because she's all the way in California. Right, right, right. And uh, like, it's just, it's just really hard for me because I lost my grandfather like in June of twenty twenty two. Right, right, right. And also like. <sighs> I don't know. It's just really hard for me to explain. Like, all I can say is, is that like I'm just I'm like really sh- like struggling with like losing both grandparents, and mm-hmm. I was really closer with my grandfather. So, um, and also his birthday, my grandfather's birthday passed. So, like, I like I started. Well, you know, just to, just just to like represent him, I started like drinking his favorite drink, and I don't know, like. I need I need your advice. Like, do you think like I should go to like California and just visit my grandmother for the last time? Because they're doing her funeral in California, but her burial is gonna be all the way in El Salvador, buried right next to my grandfather. Like, I just need like okay. I just need to know like should I go or should I not go? Okay, first of all, sorry for your loss. Um. It sounds to me like you really want to go. So my advice as far as that would be find someone. If you, if the plane ticket is the problem or whatever, find maybe some family member that may be out here that's driving there or something, or try to set that up. Uh, If you can make the drive, it's possible. I wouldn't do it all in 24 hours straight because that's how long it's going to take. No, yeah. But like, you know what I'm saying? Make it a make it a set up a two day drive if possible. Mm-hmm. You really only got three days until the thirty first. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh, if you really want to go, you'll find a way to go. If you really, really want. If you really can't go, uh, I mean, it's probably just 
the way it's gonna have to be. Uh, but yeah, if you really want to go, you can find a way to do it. Do it. Do it, do yeah, but the, uh, the only problem is is that my mother is already in California and I spoke to her about this and she was like, well, but then again, you have work and you have kids. So I'm just like, I don't know, but I'll do my best. Um, I'll do my best to like call you on FaceTime just to see her one last time, even though I'm not going to be able to like, you know, hold her hand one last time or anything. I'm only going to see her on the screen. That's the problem. And I don't know. That's just like really hard for me. I would. Yeah. So first thing is talk to your employer. Uh, talk to your employer and see what that situation is. And then if that gets handled, then talk to um, your kid's father in terms of would they be able to make the trip? Would y'all be able to all make the trip together? Would they have to stay behind? All of that stuff. It's very possible just because you have kids or whatever and you know, that don't mean it's automatic. No, you just have to talk and you just have to get it squared away ASAP. Yeah. And not wait until the 30th trying to drive to California for the 31st. So since you only got three days, it's time to wake up in the morning and talk to your employer and then go from there, depending on what they say. If they tell you no, then, I mean, you just got to kind of deal with it as it is. You already kind of figured it would be a no anyway, but there's a chance it could be a yeah. So I would go that route. Yeah. No, yeah, they, they, uh, I've already spoke to them of what happened. They're like, well, just let me know if you need any, if you need anything like extra hours or, or a couple of days off and this and that, just let me know. And I'm like, all right, cool. But, um, but other than that, like, it's, it's just a real struggle, struggle for me because, like, she's, she's lived for so long. And ever since, ever since my, my, my grandfather died, uh, she, my grandmother just felt like she's just giving up on life because she doesn't have her significant other. Like she would always mm -hmm. tell me and my mother, like, "Oh, I don't feel like eating. I feel too weak. Um, I I don't want to live like this. Like I just I really want to be with her grandfather already." And then we tell and then we tell her like, "You're like you're gonna live a little bit longer. You know, it's not it's not your time yet. Like I get it. Like you miss like you miss him, but." You, it's not it's not your time yet like yeah. you'll I mean, be with well, you. it it happens it's human emotions you know it's gonna be hard for all of her children and grandchildren and you as well yeah. uh we just gotta it's it's a part of our lives and our nature that we all know everybody has a day so yeah it just so happened that it was her day and then Ooh. in 2022 it was your grand so it's just uh, it's going to be tough, but it ain't going to be tough forever. Yeah. Uh, you know, also, you just gotta, also, you gotta remember, like you said, she lived a long life. Yeah. Long, I'm pretty long. sure that life was full of joy, full of happiness and full of great memories. And I feel like the one thing I've learned in losing people, you do them a disservice when you don't find happiness in their memory granted they're gone and it's 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 saddening but you got to remember the smile because for the most part they would have wanted you to smile they don't want you to be sad all day for the rest of your life they want you to your grandparents and parents nine times out of ten want you to go and live the best life you can live for yourself regardless of what they got going on so it's the same principle situation. yeah and as far as getting there, do everything in your power to get there. So that way, whether you get there or not, you will know you did best. everything. You tried your absolute best to get there. Because yeah. trust me, when, when we as people want something to happen that bad enough, we going to make it happen. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So try your very, very best if that's how you feel. And then live with the results knowing you tried your absolute best to make it happen. Yeah. And also, I'm probably gonna get like a like a rose tattoo that has like a cross on it, and and putting their names on 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 the tattoo. It's gonna be on my hand because I like I always pray to them and everything like that. You know, it, it was sure, just an sure. idea. For sure, yeah. Do 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 all that, man. You know, it's just, 
I mean, you got other tattoos that, you know, that you might as well get that one. Yeah, yeah but yeah, uh, yeah, feel yeah, better, yeah. Uh, Gabby. Sorry for your loss. Remember, yeah, everything's so going to be all right. And it, just give it some time. Do your best you, to get guys. there. If you can't get there, don't don't dwell on it. Just know you tried your best. Yeah. All righty. Thank you, guys. You're Thank welcome. you, Gabby. Bye. Bye-bye. Woohoo! All right. And no, I did not have a... Uh, this is my first solo Twitch, uh, people. And yes, combo, three hours. Uh, <laughs> we've been like... Uh, what up, mate? Unmute yourself if you can hear my voice. A demon doggy? Okay. De- de- hey. <laughs> demon doggy. Sorry, guys. I was in the bathroom. Can y'all hear me? Yep. Yeah. Heard yep, the whole yep, thing, yep, no. yep. Hey, Gabby, sorry for your loss. I, I couldn't say nothing. I was in the bathroom. I was so I know the name's weird, first of all. I'll explain the name reason later, but pretty much my issue is I've known this girl for like three years now. Uh-huh. And me and her used to date, right? Okay. Okay, 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 okay. okay. And she was my first real good girlfriend. I really liked her, right? All so right. she has been a lot of new things, one of them being Polly. And Polly what? pretty much is you date multiple people at once. Oh, Polly relationships. Yeah. Okay. I was like, all right, that's cool and all. I didn't really care. Whoa, so then one whoa, of her friends. Whoa, whoa, wait a minute. Wait, was oh, when really? I, said, I, didn't, I didn't care as in she didn't want to talk to people. But she was like, oh, she's cool with me doing it. So like, I didn't really care. So once okay, her okay. friends though, started flirting with me. And I was like, okay, my girlfriend's like this. So it's fine. I told my girlfriend about it. She was like, oh, she can join. And I really did love this girl. Like she was like my number one. I mean, for two years we're still friends. But after we added this girl to our relationship, all three of us were dating each other. Uh-huh. Like a month later, the main girl broke up with us, saying that she just needed like the personal space. She couldn't handle it. So like this hurt at the time, but it wasn't as bad. I still had the other girl, but it was like the feelings weren't the same at all. So you me know and the whole time you wanted the main shorty. Yeah, so pretty this much just, I was okay. stupid and it was like, okay, this girl wants me, this girl wants me, this girl wants me, I want it all. And that's pretty much a real relationship because she felt like she wasn't enough attention and she didn't want to ruin me and the other girl. So she was like, oh, it's best if I step away. And in my mind, it was like, no, I don't want you to step away. I want to keep you the other girl to step away. You're the main priority. But it was like too late at that point. So me and this girl are still friends now. Uh-huh. I still really like this girl. And the uh-huh. thing is, she sometimes still first with me, and we still sometimes talk. But she got a boyfriend now. So, oh. I don't want it to, like, the way she talks to me, she still talks like she likes me. But I don't want it to be as in, I'm waiting for her and them to break up for her to finally give me another chance. When it's like, I don't want to be the backup dude of, oh, she knows I'm a good guy. She knows I'll take care of her. But she's just going to have her phone first. Because we've Amen. like we discussed the idea three or four times of us getting back together, and uh-huh. we've both been like in and out of relationships since then, and we've stayed close friends. We still talk at least every other day, and it's like it seems like the funds are there. I just don't want to be the guy of, oh, well now you gotta wait your turn, and then when she's finally ready to settle down, then she'll come to me. All right, look, bro. You know what I'm saying? As far as right now, you got to go on. And let you pretty much gotta let it go. Oh uh, God, she in a whole relationship. She shouldn't be talking to you anyway. If my girl was talking to her, ex, nigga, <laughs> I wouldn't. Bro, I would have screenshot it. Listen, I would have screenshot it and not even said nothing to the nigga. Just sent the screenshots. Well, no, I mean, like, you could, you could sabotage, saying, but, just, but you know, I never seen on no sabotage shit because, like, you gotta think about it, I, bro. Get uh, if a person is unfaithful in their current relationship. Don't think they'd probably yeah. like. Don't I wouldn't give them the benefit of the same doubt. Same way you give them the same, the same way, way you gonna lose. Sa- them. Listen, I am a product of that. The same way you get them is the same way you lose them. I swear to God. Yeah, don't I get that, me. but right now we're not flirting. We're only flirting when she was single, and it's just she'll get in a relationship. They last a bit, they break up, and I've done the same thing. We've both been in our relationships, so right but now no, she's no, a flirting. No, 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 you gotta, you gotta, you gotta hear us out. Do y'all have conversations? While she, it doesn't matter what kind of conversations, do y'all have conversations while she's not single? What do you mean, like why, she, like while she's dating? Yes. Yeah. Do y'all even talk, talk like awesome, like super friend, awesome, like friendly shit? Nah, fuck that. 
y'all are exes. It don't work like that. True. Don't work like that. If your girl was talking to her ex, you would be looking some type of way, and I'm pretty sure the dude he nah, she dated. Nah, oh my gosh, she, if if you in a relationship and a girl find it, figure out you talking to your ex, it's raps. So yeah, uh, I don't. I say let it go, bro. Your best bet. Focus on yourself. Focus on what you want. If the one thing I'm I'm very adamant about, bro, if it ain't work out in the past and it ain't work mm -hmm. out now, I'm not worried mm -hmm. about it in the future. Mm -hmm. But the thing is, the only reason why it didn't work out was my fault. I got greedy. No, 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 no. She accepted the terms and conditions, bro. Yeah, I was getting to that. She accepted the terms and conditions. she's in a relationship, so you need to move on anyway. For two, why the fuck if you not happy with poly if you don't agree with poly relationships why would you even bring that up and say i can do it and then get mad when i do it no no what well, it's not like what? she got mad bro she, she, left. Left. she got mad she left it's more of like she no. felt like she wasn't nah, you're you're go, listen, listen twin i, I, I get you still like her because you're making excuses for her <laughs> you're, you're but that's excuses. literally what it is what you told us is what it is unless there's something you hide you can tell us all right. Yeah, yeah you know, you, yeah. you, you, you yeah. like her still and you're coping. You gotta, you yeah, gotta, let, you gotta let that like, shit go. It's healthy for you to walk, just walk away from the situation currently. If Imagine it happens right in the future, now. if it happens in the future, it happens in the future. But as of current, focus on you, focus on your happiness because what you think may make you happy, it might be something a thousand times better out there for you. <laughs> holding on, you never know if you, if you holding yourself back, waiting on something. That ain't even happy yet, yeah. especially in the fact that y'all both are getting in and out of relationships. You you might not even realize it subconsciously. Your feelings for her can have you not really in in your other relationships. Exactly. You trying to fill a hole you don't know is there. So with that being said, bro, for you to be better, it is in your best interest to just let her go right now. Focus on bettering yourself. Okay. Focus on making yourself happy okay. and living your life. The, the two biggest red flags are A, she brought up some shit that she would allow you to do and when you did it, she left the relationship. That's red flag number one. B, she's in a relationship talking to exes. That is a no-no. So if, if she break up with old dude and then six months after that, a year after that, get with you, what makes you think she ain't gonna talk to other exes? Why y'all together? Yeah, you right. Exactly. So who's to say you the only ex she in communication with? Ooh, I mean, right. I know all her exes, and I know it don't matter. Right. It don't matter. I'm just saying. Yeah, you're right. All you right. Know? Like how how can how can she hop in a relationship, still talking with you? All right, it's friendly right now because I'm in a relationship. Break up with the nigga and immediately start flirting flirting with you. All right, I'm single. I'm flirting with you again. Hop in another relationship. All right, I'm in a relationship. We gotta be friends. Like no, <laughs> no, you still got feelings. All right. Also, I will say this too about the the reason why my username is like this is because when we first started dating, her username was it's a demon kitty. So I made my username this, and after that, it just stuck with me. Okay. Change All your right. fucking username and leave that motherfucker alone. Change everything about you that reminds you. Of Get rid of her. Yeah. I had a feeling y'all would say this too. I was just hoping it'll be something else. All right. No, nah, you being delusional. We get on TikTok every day talking about delusional ass women on these podcasts. You were being delusional because you still in love with the girl. Cut her off. Change the username. Get her out of system. It's hard. I know it, damn it. But damn. <laughs> <laughs> I'll live it. All right. Thanks for the nice game. I love you guys. I've been watching since the racist Mario video. Right, hey, you too, gang. I right, love you. my brother. Stop being delulu. <laughs> Stop being delusional, chat. Damn it. Shit. E mad, it's your last chance. What up? Hello. Can you hear me? Yeah. Good evening. How art thou? What do you want to get off your chest? Well, I had a bad experience being arrested. <laughs> and it had traumatized me. After that. Okay, and. Okay. And the thing is, it's not even my fault. It was somebody else's fault, and I got convicted of it. Not convicted, like, but arrested because of it. And that's 
Seeing turret like it give me PTSD. <laughs> and the reason of the arrest was because of Chat GPT. Right. So I had this roommate. We shared the uh, an account with each other. Like roommates, we pay for each other's stuff, right? Right, but right, right. But the account was for me. And mm -hmm. this guy searched a lot of messed up shit. Oh no! Uh, yeah, he did a lot of messed up shit because the account was in my name and my <sighs> credit card. <sighs> Bro, he posted something online, and somebody sued him. And I'm not sure you know the terms and conditions of ChatGPT, but if a person sued ChatGPT or the content first, they are gonna come after the person. Yeah, that... they come after me, and they didn't get my roommate. <sighs> and I was like, "Fuck!" And at that time, he didn't pay me, right? Pay me for ChatGPT because groceries and other stuff. I mean, like a student, right? So he didn't pay right away. To, like I said to the judge. It's half of a half, right? For the subscription. So, yeah. And. Ah, you ain't snitch. I didn't say anything. You ain't I snitch. Said, Shit. No. Man, yeah. you better than me. Shit. What? I don't care. I, I gotta prove it. You should have snitched. <laughs> no, 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 no. I cannot do that. That's unacceptable. What? It's... Unacceptable? What you do? <laughs> like you get in trouble for the situation is acceptable yeah no the nah. thing is I, no the thing is uh, all the uh, uh, charges he paid for it so <laughs> you got the charges yeah but the thing is i didn't say it was his fault i was saying multiple people was using it i didn't say his name and wait 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 okay wait 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 yeah do you have a record because of this? Do you have a criminal record because of this? No, no, no. Okay. I live in Canada. Oh, yeah, drop. Okay, okay. Canada does not like that. Okay, yeah, yeah. so you just got basically sued because of this, and he paid. Yeah, for it. sued and a little bit arrested. And that's the arresting part is a little bit scary. So how, how they arrested you? How long they kept you? One day and a half. Oh, okay, 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 okay. okay it's not okay, that okay. much. So he I paid just, for everything. Anything over three everything. hours, I'm snitching. <laughs> you you better than me, bro. You a civilian. Oh, well, I hope you a civilian, damn it. You a civilian. Uh, snitching, so. don't, snitching don't count for us. The hell we talk about? If I ain't get threatened by Pablo Escobar, I'm snitching. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> uh, <laughs> hey, hey, don't do nothing around me. I'm snitching. <laughs> don't give me no gun. You know what I'm gonna do. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So like, and okay. Are there? Are there, is it? Is this? Is this situation still going on? Is that why you in therapy no, for it? No. The thing is, the you know when they do that during that you know put him in the police car or just stuff. It's like you know it flashes back like they force uh... on me. They keep me underground. I didn't do shit. Like, I see all these arresting stuff for movies. When I see it happen to me, I was so shocked. I still cannot go come out of it. So you got PTSD from the from getting arrested? Yeah, like... But all right, still. look, Twin. Look, Twin. Uh, <laughs> if the situation is fully resolved, at yeah. the end of the day, if you don't owe nobody no fines or nothing, or whatever, you good with ChatGBT, yeah. you good with the law, you yeah. only was in jail for a day and a half. I say stop being pussy for real. They kept you in that bitch for a day. You wasn't in there for months, nigga. Come on, man. We was true, in Canadian true. jail. But, but if somebody else in this chat does something and you go to jail for it, what do you feel? But I think, <laughs> I'm I'm, first of all, I'm snitching. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Second of all, if it's I was good. only in there for a day, it's it's a it's going to be a story time. And it is what it is, bro. You know what I'm saying? If as long as as long as he paid for everything, and I'm you know I don't got no criminal record, all that shit. We it's, it is what it happened. Bro. Okay, it happened. if Aaron, Man. for example, it was Aaron, would you snitch on Aaron? Hell yeah! <laughs> shit, shit. Okay, for sure. Hey nigga, looking up. Some hey nigga, you shit, did something to get me in trouble? Yeah. They say nothing. Shit. shit. <laughs> yeah. You ain't my friend anyway. If you're doing exactly. something that'll get me in trouble, shit. Aaron, I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, I'm, 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 sorry I'm, 
I, I feel like if I do some crazy shit on his account, he should snitch on me too. Cause that's crazy. Oh, my God. I, re- I respect it. <laughs> the 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 rules I follow ain't ain't they don't like they apply to me too. So if yeah. I'm a snitch on somebody, if they did something to me, they should snitch on me if I do something to them. Oh baby, like, that was my fault. I I did the stupid shit. Oh baby. You know what I'm but and let me tell you another thing about ChatGPT turns and condition. If you yeah, sue, yeah, if you sue for Chat ChatGPT, basically you should pay for their lawyers. You should pay for their everything it, because it's in the terms and conditions. So did he pay and, for all that? No, I'm just uh, saying the terms and conditions of ChatGPT. Mm. Anyone who, if you put something on Twitter or anything else. And the person doesn't like it, and he he sues you. You should defend ChatGPT. Why you put that statement in the Twitter or whatever? I don't even understand. Oh, oh, yeah, oh, I know it's a bullshit, but I'm just telling you so you guys don't have, have to, it doesn't happen oh, to you. Shit, oh, shit, man. Hey, stop sharing accounts with people. First of all, yeah, bro, I mean, you don't, that you can't. Well, it's still wait. thirty dollars for ChatGPT four. You know. It's the latest stop. version, but still. Stop trusting that roommate is the first step. Bro, <laughs> yeah. they live with each other for one year. I don't know what what kind of fucking fetish did he have? He put you, the messed up shit. <laughs> wait, you've only lived with him for a year total? No, uh, I know him about five years. But I lived okay, with okay. him in one year. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. yeah, don't trust that nigga no more. Don't let him around none of your <laughs> stuff. No, don't no let him log in. Don't Bruh. let him. Don't let him use your. Let nothing. me tell you something. Did you ever heard an account be become deactivated for ChatGPT? Uh, no, but I'm. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure. What, what, can... what would you do to get it? <laughs> yeah. God damn. Listen, bro, that is, not he's a criminal, bro. <laughs> bro, that deactivated the account. I, I cannot. Go go to... Probably act. Do you know mad? what he was? You know what he was searching? I don't, I don't want to know. Bruh, I don't want to say it, but it was adult content. No, yeah. Chat GPT. So instead of going to the adult content, oh, he searched it on bro. Chat GPT. Hey, bro, erase him. And wanted it to read it out to him. <laughs> <laughs> he was writing Chat GPT fanfics or something. Bro, this, bro. Oh. In the court, I was so ashamed. <laughs> like they were oh. saying. Oh, oh the no, no, they was reading oh. like it was you. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, oh, I would have yeah. we snitched and we got a squabble, buddy. What are we doing? What are we doing? What are we yeah. doing? Shit. Yeah, appreciate so you. you saying, yeah. yeah, have a nice day. N- night. Yeah, no. Yeah, no don't trust, time, don't trust his horny ass. <laughs> get his horny ass bro, out of here, bro. Get him out of your <laughs> life before you get in trouble. Yeah, of him. bro. But well, he take it deeper, bro. What? Take Thank deeper. you, Mikey. Thank oh, you. Boy, shit. Thank you, bro. Oh, All right, right, baby. All right, bro. Yeah. What the hell are we talking that's about? Freaky ass nigga. Freaky ass nigga. Now nah, getting banned by AI is insane. insane. Bro, he had to be looking at some nut stuff, like something nut. insane. If it was adult cunt, if it's adults on the screen and you getting banned, bro, the thing what? is, what are you doing in chat, chat bro? GBT, bro. And you know what's so crazy? Everybody in the courtroom think he freaky as hell. Yeah, freaky bro, as the fun. craziest part. I'm like, bro, what? How far? Like. What can chat? I only know it to print out prompts. Exactly. Uh, Nicholas, the living liar. What up? Hello. <laughs> what? How you doing, Nick? Yeah, we're going. Well, how do speak? <laughs> oh my god. Okay, <laughs> yeah, tell my camera if I want to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, mine actually, it was not so long ago, so. Um, Are you fuck. able to type in mute chat for this? Not for this. Not for a whole therapy session. No, no, no. All right, Nick. Fuck, is it working? It was. You turned it off. What the fuck? Uh, it, oh, it's yeah. going on and off. Oh. Mm-mm-mm. One, it was one more there. try. Oh, we'll try, we'll try. Yeah. Oh, okay. okay, all right. Just go ahead. Just go ahead with you. Go ahead with what you got, bro. What the fuck? Right, Isn't this got. working, man? Yeah, nah, it fuck it. Why not? It's on. There we go. It's on. Putting on my fucking screen. So yeah, yeah. yeah it's it's on. We're looking at you, bro. Oh, this is what I see. 
Like, I don't see anything. That's you. Show what, to you. Look, look, look into the right. That God. screen you see in? Oh, he's, you. he's a box of rocks. <laughs> Wait, you can't see my phone. Come on, Nick. You see how his, ahead, if you bro, look at the if you look at the stream is you see how little people in the stream. Clint, you got a toothpick in your mouth with a hat. There you go. You, you saw you yourself. Bro. All right, all right, all right, all right. <laughs> I can see myself on screen, but it's not my phone. All right, so yeah, give me a question. A, qu- a question? I mean, sorry. <laughs> What's on your mind, Nick? This therapy, bro. Oh, okay. Nick, yeah, you've so- been watching the stream this whole fucking time, Nick. Not, not really. I was eating. Nick, Nick, why are you here? You was here. Nick, why are you here? Nick, Nick, why are you here? You heard me saying we was doing things. Okay, okay. I just want to say that I just want to get a a thing off my mind. I just need advice for something. Like, okay, so what? We listening. We listening. Good. We we listening, bro. Oh, okay. (laughs) See, lately, um. This friend and I, you know, we've been best friends for a long time, like six years. And right, right, right. It's a guy. No, it's a girl. Oh, and, shit. okay. Bet, bet, bet. Yeah, and like, keep in mind, I've always been there for her. Been a right. good. Friend. I even gave her a cake on her birthday while no one was there for her. Right, right, right. And then like, and um, a little personal, like someone that she loved passed away. And I was there for her too. Like I basically like, hey, like I get it. People come in and out of your life. People right. pass away, but I get it. I lost people in my time. I lost my grandpa, two of my uncles, and my dog that I've been watching since fifth grade. And yeah, I know that different people cope with it. Like they tend to like grief of it. For me, it took me like a few months, but for her, like it's been forever. I told her like, yeah, I get it she's she's not here no more but she's always there with you in your heart and you got to move on you can't like keep dwelling over it because the more you dwell over it life's not gonna be special no more right right w friend advice okay so what's the what's the issue now then she's not a very she's not grateful for what i do you know like one day Mm. she's just one day she stopped talking to me and then after that block no explanation like nothing just nick are you crazy what are Are you you crazy i'm paranoid yeah okay so i'll say this nick um when you do stuff for people the the sucky part about it you don't have to don't expect the thank yous right yeah yeah yeah, yeah. I know that. Like, I don't expect anything. Okay. Yeah, it's like I'm not that type of person that like that gives you something and expects something back. Like, so you broke up. You broke up. You broke up. Can't hear you, Nick. You muted. You muted. You muted. You muted, you muted, you muted, yourself. muted. You muted yourself. So you, okay. okay. Do you hear me now? You yeah. 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 So like, so like, is the problem that she's starting to act weird? Is that the problem? No, it was just, yeah. Mm. Okay, so just my uncle was talking to me, but yeah, um, no, she wasn't acting weird or anything. It's just she just been distant. That's what know. I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. She's starting to be. Yeah. She's starting to be distant and whatnot. And keep and and keep in mind, this is not the first time this happened. Like. Like, I mean, I'm the type of person that gives second chances, but like immediately I should like be like, no, like I'm done. Even though, yeah, we've been through a lot lately. We had all those good memories, but that ain't going to put up shit after what you put me through. Okay. So, so, so you mentioned her blocking you. Uh, does yeah. she like, what do you be doing? Nick? Cause you, you literally just got on here acting like a box of rocks real quick. So like. What you be doing no, before she block you? Nothing really. I just I hurt it hurt a bit. Kind of sad, like like years of friendship is out of the window. Like what the fuck? But then I realized, like okay, first of all, if it's easy for you to oh wait, how do I say? It? Sorry. It, oh, sorry. <laughs> 
I was gonna say, yeah, if it's easy for you to let me go out of your life, then it should be easy for me to let you go out, out of, wait, if it's easy for you to let me go out of your life, it should be easy for me to let you go out of my life. So why so this, is what I say, know, this, is what I, this is what I'll say, Nick. In this situation, it's in your best interest just to, if she's distancing herself from you, just let it go. Focus on yourself. Focus on your happiness. Focus on your own path, and keep her at a distance. You know, don't you don't don't be readily available for someone, regardless of your your past with that person. Don't be available for someone who's not who show they don't care, bro. So you just let that person go and keep it pushing. Yeah, I had plenty of shitty friends we I done stuff for, but once they proved that they would never will forever be shitty, it. Yeah, get them out of here. Get them out of here. It see like. What really pissed me off is that she wants to come back now. Like, like I know, like, yeah, it pisses me off, but she texted me saying that, like, oh, like, I was going through a lot, that, like, I just needed to cope by myself. Okay. But you could have told me that to begin with, instead of just telling me now after months of waiting. Your best, I, like I say, your best bet, just let that go. Focus on yourself, bro. Yeah, and if she wants to come back, regardless. Get her, get her gone, bro. Get her gone. Oh, yeah. If she put up a good fight, then it might be worth thinking about continuing to be a friend. But like nine times out of ten, she's just gonna go ghost again anyway. So just True. get it out of here. You know what I'm True. saying, and, yeah, like, and live, live for thing. yourself, bro. Go do, go do your thing, bro. Exactly. Go get some bitches on your dick, fuck nigga. <laughs> yeah. Shit. All right, Nick. Yeah, don't don't right, shit over it. Have a good one, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, type B, type B, type B. All right, we're going to do two more. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> damn, where the hell y'all come from? <laughs> damn. Uh, mm-hmm. Aaron, pick somebody at random. Uh, well, we'll do two more, ex- not excluding Mountain Dew. I'll say Xavier. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Type uh-huh. you, you, you okay? You still there? Yeah. Why are you bald? Why are you here, nigga? It's therapy, nigga. What you got on your chest? Do you want to get off your chest? Ah. Uh. Uh. <laughs> Come on, man. Come on, man. What are we doing? Wasting time. Oh, wasting, wasting time. Out of time. My, whoa. Is that a whip sound when that you was a fucking whip. It might no, be racist. Don't yeah. worry about it. All right. That's about crazy. It. That's, <laughs> that's insane. I've low-key forgot from last time. So how y'all doing? How you doing, man? We doing good, man. It's, it's a great therapy session so far. What you want to get yeah. on your chest, big dog? I mean, are you are you okay? I'm listening. Okay, just making sure. Some friend of mine, she's um, she's going through some stuff, and I just right, right, I'm, right, not, right, right. I'm not sure how I want to help her. I'm not sure how to help her. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Cause like, cause she she's she's young, she's my age, and so, and she's she's had a, she's had a real shit childhood. She's had a lot of stuff happen to her. Okay, okay, and like. She she's scared of people in a sense. Like she she like the few people she does trust, she keeps very close to her heart. Mm-hmm. Right. And I I want to be there to help her, but I also don't want to push it. And like because of her past and because of her history, like with her trust issues. So it's it's that weird in between phase. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm, I'm there, I can't help. I want to help. And I figured, you know, why not ask for some people for advice on how I could you know help her, or at least be there more than I already am. Uh, extend the olive branch, bro. Tell her, bro, just be up front with it. Yo, I want to help you. I I don't want to push yeah, situation. I, I have. It's just like she she says, like, like and I quote, like, I I love it. I appreciate it. She just doesn't know how to accept help for one, and she doesn't like. She has a hard time accepting help, and she has a hard time just like talking about her issues, even though like I, she knows I know about her issues, but it's like her actually saying it. You just gotta, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta keep it gentle. You know what I'm saying? 
Sometimes yeah. people just don't know how to express or they haven't figured it out yet. And yeah. if she, you just got to keep it gentle and keep letting her know you're there for her. Don't like spam it. Don't, you know, saying get yeah. on her nerves or nothing like that. She's fine. Just, She's fine. Yeah, yeah. Just keep it, keep it. Give her her space while also letting her know, hey, I am here for you. I know you might not know how to say what you're going through, but like, yeah. I'm here to listen type of joint. As long as you as long as you feel like it's clear that she knows that you're here. Well, then... I, I, I express it like multiple times every time I see her, like, hey, you mean anything I'm here day or night? Yeah. Other than that, just try your best to like, you know what I'm saying? Show her a good time, essentially. Like when y'all do get to hang together or talk, just just keep it light. Yeah. Make show her yeah. the better parts of life and friendship. And when she's ready to talk, she should know. You know, through your you. actions that she can come to you, basically. Gotcha. Okay. Okay. All right. I was already gonna do that, but this just this just affirms and just kind of backs my decisions up. Yeah, so yeah, I, yeah. I I really appreciate it. You no love problem. me, brother. And leave her grandma alone. Yeah. Yeah. yeah for sure. Leave her it's different. You yeah. know this. You know the yeah, yeah, type shit. I was just letting him know. Leave like you know, type shit. Uh, let's see. I see shadow in the in the in the in the, in the motherfucking in the motherfucking shit. Oh. Um. What up? Oh, what the fuck? Yeah. Tomer fifty six eighty. Who is you in Discord? God damn it! You'll be, you'll be, the, you'll be. You know what I'm saying? Last one, Ace. Second to last. Yeah. You got something you wanna... God damn! God damn! damn. I'm gonna lock into my twin. What you want to get off your chest? Get easy, Aaron, Mike, yeah, y'all doing? Yo, God damn, doing good, long ass right? intro. That's what the damn, man. Fuck, nigga. Wow. Damn, nigga, why you hiding? Like, you got a bandana on the fedora. This nigga's a gangster square, nigga. What the fuck you got going on? Is that a ace twin? Twin, what's good? What's good? What's good? Twin, is that a bandana fedora? Oh, there it is. A bandana yeah, fedora, ski glasses. These niggas are super gangsters. <laughs> yes, My God. <laughs> this nigga Ace My is a murderer. God. I mean, nigga. nigga where your light at? You got on all black. black. You got on all black with no light. I don't need... I, I'm stuck on the floor yeah. with the data. All black. What's, what's, what's up, son? Hey, man. Bro, you about to give me an epileptic seizure in this bitch. Gotta... What you want to get off your chest, bro? Yeah. So you know how many niggas you robbed? Everybody got a little bit of crazy in them. No, I can't say that. No, I'm joking. Just you. I, I, you know, nice. wait, 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 wait. I gotta rob somebody. But you know, everybody got a little bit crazy in them. You know, there's times where my intrusive thoughts be running wild and shit. You know, the violent tendencies every now and then. It's like, for example. Back in high school, I used to be the nigga who got picked on. Okay. Every now and then, everybody has been picked on and whatnot, right? Right, right, cool. right. And then, you know, they'd be like, oh, tell an adult, or you need therapy. I used to get told every single time you need therapy. Right. Because, you know, you have a random outburst where you will go and you'll snap on someone, you start getting violent. And it's mm -hmm. like, it don't seem like it helps. You know, because back in, like, fifth grade, I had therapy for passing. Someone in here earlier, sorry for your loss. I understand that feels. Um, whenever people say certain stuff, it's like trigger words. Right, like right. You got Y and S. I'm a Y and S. I just don't need no switch. I got my hands. So, okay. you know, there's times when people say some trigger words and stuff, and it'll set me off. Say the wrong thing to the wrong person. It'll set me off in the violent tendencies will sit there and they'll start to go off and it gets worse. Mm -hmm. I feel like one of these days, if it goes unchecked, I feel like I could probably hurt somebody in a bad way. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Know what you mean? Know what you mean? Good show. So, um, I can tell you one thing, high school. Continue, continue. I was going to say, look into, uh, I don't know a lot of resources out there for this type of issue outside of like the general term anger management. But like, if that's something you haven't explored yet, I will look into that on a serious note. Oh, um, uh, yoga, 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 Pilates, and weightlifting. There you go. There you go. Okay, okay. 
You need uh, you need an outlet. You don't yeah. have an outlet. Could boxing, boxing, yeah. Muay Thai. The only reason, the only reason I don't say like a combat right. sport. The only reason I don't say a combat sport because it could lead, it could trigger you in yourself. You got. That's you gotta, what I've uh, been speaking of in a long term short. You know, when I was doing boxing for one old schools, I got jumped. Remember, I mentioned about the council sitting back there with the you know what on it. Um, before that. I remember when I was in private school, I was doing boxing. I was being trained by one of my uncles. And so when they started picking on me and when they slashed me by my eye. So I went and I blacked out and I went and I swung. When I came back to my senses, you know, like the bulletproof glass that they had by the doors for mm-hmm. uh, schools and stuff in this day and age. Bulletproof age. glass? What the yeah, what I sent him through that. You went- yeah, right. yeah, I yeah. sent him through it. School in Iraq. Okay. The suburbs, but the police ain't around the corner. All right, that's crazy work. Okay. But uh, you know, he made me mad. I mean, all I remember is he grabbed me by my face. He went, he slammed me into the locker, face first, and on the concrete floor. So I got up, and all I remember before I grabbed him, I started beating on him, and then I went out to him through the bulletproof glass window, the door. Right, look, I would recommend what Aaron said: yoga, a little meditation. Uh. First and foremost, you are Bayan. on the internet now. What did you say? I said some banyan. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. You know? yeah, yeah, yeah. Some ass. Yeah, wrong, right? you know, some cheeks. Minute, oh, some cheeks you know what I'm saying? Find you a nice lady that can calm you down real quick. Chill out. Uh, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Get your soft side going. You know what I'm saying? Maybe maybe knock up a hooker or something. Get you a daughter in this world. You know, they might soften you up. Whoa, uh, whoa, like a pit bull whoa, or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, hooker. Uh, but on a serious note you are on the internet now no matter how big or small the audience your face is out there you gotta think about that uh you be in these streams and stuff you gotta think about that you know what i'm saying uh you know you gotta take up some meditation or some yoga or something you gotta you gotta you gotta learn we're adults now we can't be doing that stuff. Hey, if, if nobody ain't I can't be crashing out over there. Yeah, somewhere. nobody ain't you know? coming up on you trying to rob you or something. Can't be doing that. You know what I'm yeah, bro. Yeah, I'm already out of here. I can't be doing that. Yeah. The one thing you gotta remember, bro. You you can't crash out over words, bro. The yeah. the the one thing the one thing you have to be in the utmost control of is yourself. Because crash the moment the moment you don't control yourself is the moment you lose. Yeah. They in con- it's cool to like joke with your friends about crashing out and all or whatever, but to actually crash out and be an actual crash out, it's not okay. It ain't it's not okay. It ain't okay. It ain't fun. And it's not. It's just dangerous. It's not. Um, it makes you come off as dumb because people don't know people that might see you crash out don't know you for you. They know you as the crash out. Same thing with the with yep. the police and the law and the justice system. They don't know Ace, who might <laughs> stream over here and hang with his girl or whatever. They know the crash out that that beat a nigga up in the middle of the street. That's all they see. That's all they know. The nigga in the ski mask and the fedora. All they beat, 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 beat that man <laughs> within the inch of his life. <laughs> <laughs> the frightening fedora killer or something. That's all, that's all they see. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's in your it's in your best interest, bro. It's in and your best in interest, all, bro. All in all, the weakest trait we have sometimes is crashing out in anger. Yeah, we, it take a lot that more. You take a better person. The better person is the one that can control itself and and learn to that shit ain't worth it. It's it's almost never really worth it if we being honest. It's almost it's never weird. really worth it. Because that's how my biological brother is, too. I try staying away from him because he does the yeah. same thing, but it's worse. There's been times where I almost got into a physical altercation with him over some stupid stuff. And I sort of reflected on it recently. I'm like, you know, I'm starting to be more and more like him in that sense. And I hate that. My mom didn't raise me that way, so I ain't trying to be that way. But yeah. it's still yeah. that arrogance from when I was around him. It just you have the wherewith- my head. So you have the wherewithal to know what you've done in the past and what you might do in the future. If you can't change it from here, then that's on you because you you are aware. You are self-aware of what you are doing. 
So you can no longer grow into the rest mm -hmm. of your adult life saying I blacked out. I did no. You know what you was doing. Somebody do some d slightly disrespectful yeah. stuff. Let it go. Keep eating dinner or whatever the fuck yeah. you would. Let it walk the fuck. It's never. It's never worth it. And oh, you, God, you do some stupid shit. Then. You do some stupid shit. And you you sitting in jail talking about some. Why did I do that? It wasn't worth it, was it? No. I give a fuck about. All right, you you fucking yeah, you no. you you shoulder checked me in the club real quick. I don't give a fuck. All right, let me go get a drink or something. Damn. All right, he shoulder checked me. I can tell the story. Nigga shoulder checked me. Uh, this happened. I looked at him. Blah blah. I, at least I'm not in jail because I he shoulder checked me and I fucking shot him or something. You know what I'm saying? Like it ain't yeah, working. In jail, I'm sitting in front of God trying to claim my yeah. early gates. Because the one thing work. I notice, I do that. I'm not just hurting myself. I'm hurting everybody that fucked with me around me. Exactly. Whether it be my parents, homies, you know. You know what I'm saying? You do some stupid shit, and they like Ace mm -hmm. from Internet City Street. Why are we attacked? Why are we attached to what this nigga did? <laughs> I don't know that nigga. Know that nigga. <laughs> <laughs> he wearing ski mask on stream. I don't know that nigga for real. Nah, but for real, focus focus <laughs> on yourself, bro. Focus on mastering yourself. The moment you master yourself, yeah. that's the moment you win, bro. For sure. Oh my God! Self control. Most you have to be able to master the bait. Yeah. Type shit. Okay. I um... don't. <laughs> <laughs> like you know when it's a successful edging session and when you like you can't control it. Type. Oh my God! Yeah. Once you learn how to master the bait, you're golden, man. Mm -hmm. I can start nutting on niggas' shoes hey, when shit. they disrespect you or something. Shit. Hell. Don't do that. Yeah, yeah. No, no, somebody's shoes. Wait a minute, nigga. Yeah, nigga. You do you do you fuck Whoa. with me with nut on your shoes, bro? That's 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 how you going to prison. They that's literally That's yeah. prison. My fault. And that, that's prison in the in a black person moment. My fault, my fault. That's uh, yeah, just, you right, you right. Just calm down a little bit, bro. Yeah. Bro, just tell me not to be a character. Let me crash out and be disrespectful in the person. Disproportionately crash out too with that. That's did y'all did, did y'all hear? Appreciate you, Ace, by the way. But y'all hear? Yeah, we saw the nigga that nutted on the lady leg. There was another, but there one. Was another one that nutted on somebody's I, back. I no crazy. way! That shit crazy. Yeah. It, bro, right now they like a linebacker. He was walking was through the store just edging. Yes. What's wrong with you? Just insane. Yeah, yeah, appreciate you, Ace man. Get that. You got to get that. I'm your gooner, gooner, yeah. yeah, yeah. You're, oh my God. you're a goofy yeah, gooner, yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right, Ace, we're going to get the last person in this joint. You feel it? You later, bro. All right. You have a good night, man. All right, you too. Ooh, know what? We're all, all right. Goofy gooners, yeah. Goofy, goofy, Tomer, goofy. Tomer, Tomer, Tomer. Hello. Hello. You're definitely oh, You're in the name. chat. You see this? Tight shit. I'm going to make a jersey. There you go. Say. Unmute. Gooner Nation. Hey, how y'all doing? We doing great, man. We doing great. Oh, what, what? Someone in there. What up? Uh, yeah, that's, that's awesome. That's awesome. That's, that's awesome, right? Uh, yeah, I just want to say just thank you for everything you bring to, like, the world and Yes, that you know, you're you're all worthy of love and you're all cared for and you know, people will go ahead and say, you know, you know, you're you're not worthy of love, you you're this, you're that, you're, yes, you know I'm, like I get hate all the time too, but you know don't let people like like that dictate your life. Because Yes, sir. Don't don't keep because those people are not you. Those people a lot. You you dictate your life. You dictate your decisions. Don't let other people dictate those decisions for you. He tell you know? them the truth. That okay. applies to AC and, and everybody else. That guy to everybody. That guy to everybody here. Not just you. That applies to everybody who's watching the stream. That's everybody who is you know in the Discord. Everybody in general. So I just want to say that, and also that you know. You guys are loved, you guys are cared for, and you guys really like make the world a better place. And just thank you Appreciate for you, big dog. Appreciate and, you, man. Thank yeah, you for the and, words and, of and, encouragement. And no problem, man. I just want to say this because, you know, I just want to make, if I could just make one person's day better every single day, that's all that matters to me. Because 
don't care how much it is, just because what if that gift can really just like help out a person, you know? Yes, sir. Bro. Yes, sir. I'm not gonna lie. To, not gonna lie to you, Tomer. Not gonna lie to you, Tomer. We appreciate the words of advice. You know what I'm saying? Uh, chat. Uh, we just want to let you know, us and chat. Like, uh, I understood you, but they can't understand you. But that's all right, cause my man said, "Don't let people dictate your life," and all that stuff like that. Everything's up to you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. You live your life, and he just want to make one person out there smile. That was his message. We appreciate yeah. you, big dog. Yeah, exactly. And no, no problem, man. You can, you can take it out. Y'all have a great rest of your night and um, stay blessed. Like, stay, job blessed right stay blessed, dog. Stay blessed. 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 That's been a great uh, therapy session. My folks, uh, my, my former, my, my, my partner therapist need to, you know what I'm saying, get up out of here. Tight shit. Tight yeah. shit. Tight shit. Appreciate y'all being here. You're welcome. Uh, have, a, have a good rest of your stream, man. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right. Yes, man. Appreciate right. you, Sim Blazy. No problem.